How are you? Hope you all are doing well. In our previous class, we discussed regarding rotation, revolution, the sun, moon, isn't it? Today, we are going to discuss regarding phases of moon. Actually, every night the shape of moon is different, isn't it? Yes. Actually, the moon does not really change its shape. This is due to the due to, due to revolution of the moon around the earth. Okay. That's why we can feel that the moon changes shape. Actually, the moon does not change its shape. That is the phases of moon. Phases of moon. The day-to-day -day changes in the shape of the moon as seen from the earth are called phases of moon. The day-to-day -day changes in the shape of the moon as seen from the earth are called phases of moon. There are different phases of moon. First one, new moon. Second one, crescent moon. Third one, half moon. Fourth one, gibbous moon. And the fourth one, full moon. Okay, first one, new moon. Look at the picture. When the moon is between the earth and sun, we cannot see the moon at all. This is called new moon. It is dark on the new moon night. Okay, second one, crescent moon, crescent moon. Look at the picture. Two or three days after new moon, we can see some part of the moon. It is called crescent moon, crescent moon. Okay, then half moon. The third one, half moon. Look at the picture. Children, look at the picture. Yes. About a week after new moon, we can see half of the moon. It is called half moon. About a week after new moon, we can see half of the moon. It is called half moon. Okay. Then fourth one, gibbous moon. Can you see the picture? Yes. Two or three days after half moon, we can see more than half of the moon. It is called gibbous moon. At the time of gibbous moon, we can see more than half of the moon. Okay. The last one, full moon. Full moon. Can you see the picture? Yes. About two weeks after new moon, we can see complete moon. It is called full moon. Children, about two weeks after New moon, we can see the complete moon. It is called full moon. Full moon. These are the different phases of moon. Okay, children. Okay, then stars. Stars. Children, have you ever wondered what the stars are? Have you ever wondered what the stars are? Actually, stars are heavenly bodies. Huge heavenly bodies have their own light. Okay. Children, you know most of the stars are bigger than our sun. But they look so small, isn't it? Why? Because the stars are far away from our earth. That's why we can feel that they are so small. Children, have you ever seen telescope? Yes. Look at the picture. This is telescope. This telescope is used to observe stars. Okay. Stars are there in the sky all the time. But during daytime, we are not able to see the stars. Isn't it? Why? Because during daytime, the sunlight is brighter than the light of the star. That's why we are not able to see the stars during daytime. Children, look at the picture. This is pole star or drutara. Pole star or drutara. It is the only stationary star in the sky. It helps to find the north direction. In olden days, when there, are, there were no instrument like magnetic compass, sailors used to take help of pole star to find their ways. Children, the pole star in olden days, there were no magnetic compass, instrument like magnetic compass. That time, the sailors used this no, a pole star to find out direction. Okay, it is the only stationary star in the sky. Children, have you seen the group of stars in the sky? Yes. Some stars are arranged in groups and form patterns in the sky. It's called constellation. It is called constellation. Totally, there are 88 
एट कॉन्स्टिलेशन इन द स्काई एटी एट कॉन्स्टिलेशन इन द स्काई समर अल्जा मेजर लियो स्कॉर्पियस अरायन एक्सेट्रा देन गैलेक्सी गैलेक्सी द सोलर सिस्टम स्टार्स एंड कॉन्स्टिलेशन टूगेदर फॉर गैलेक्सी ओके सोलर सिस्टम स्टार्स एंड कॉन्स्टिलेशन टूगेदर फॉर गैलेक्सी Our solar system is a part of galaxy called the Milky Way. Milky Way. It is the our solar system is a part of the galaxy called the Milky Way. It is spiral in shape. It is spiral in shape. So, children, I am going to wind up this session. In this session, we discuss regarding phases of moon, the stars, and the galaxy. Okay, children. Thank you.